Today, you're going to make a rainbow rocket. You're going to learn how to blend the color wheel in order and create a metal tooled rocket. First, you're going to start with a piece of white paper and a marker. You're going to draw two wavy lines from the bottom corners to the top. So they go in just a little bit. So we're going to study the color wheel and make sure that we know that it does not have a beginning or an end. For this example, I started with red. For this example, I started with violet. And I'm going to go around this way. I left off at green, so next is yellow. When you guys do this, you have to make sure that you go in order of the color wheel, or else it won't blend and it won't look like it goes together. Notice how I kind of scribbled on the color because I have to leave a little space in between for when I blend with my finger. Leaving that white space allows the colors to blend together and mix. Make sure you're filling in all of the space in between the black wavy lines. Then cut it out. Make sure you take your trash that you cut out and leave it in the corner of the table. You do not get up and throw it in the trash can. You're going to get a piece of gray paper. You're going to write your name on the back, your class code, and then I'll bring you an Elmer's glue bottle. Put about eight dots of glue. Make sure to get the corners. Flip and stick. Make sure it lines up with the bottom. Then with a yellow or white poster crayon, you're going to draw stars in the background for a rainbow rocket to blast off into outer space. Now we get to work on the metal tooling part. Metal tooling is the art of using a pointy wooden stick to press on one side of a soft metal sheet, creating a design on the back side. Metal embossing sheets are very soft and easy to cut, so artists don't have to work too hard to create a design. I put a kit together for you. Inside, grab out a piece of aluminum metal, which is the same soft metal that a soda can is made out of. With a sharpie, write your name, and then put a piece of cardboard underneath and make sure your name is flipped over to the back. You can look at the rocket idea sheets or practice using a sketch first. So when your metal is on top of the piece of cardboard, hold it down with one hand and press medium to pretty hard with the wooden stick. That will ensure that the metal tooling actually shows up and it is pressed down on your aluminum piece. Don't forget to include lots of interesting details on your rocket ship. If there's still time left over, grab a small piece of white paper and add some things in the background, like planets, UFOs, or aliens. When it's time to clean up, clip it in your table clip, and my number two people, put it in the class drawer. Next week, we will cut it out and glue it to the top of our rainbow exhaust.